What up, YouTube? As you can see, he pulled the lever and became Battlestar Rex. So, let's review it. Battlestar Rex includes a pair of socks. You know? Okay. Whoop. And you can see I did not botchy the packaging. And I do like the gear motif. In case you were wondering, botchy, I believe, is Japanese term for messed up, destroyed, or mispronouncing things. I'm pretty sure... It's one of them. Uh, let's go with the pair of sacks, Evo. Um, hair is actually mowed pretty well. And this Evo's made some appearances in the show via not yellow. I believe it was brown. Um, pretty cool, Evo. I dig it. It stands pretty well. Let's, um, let it just wander. Now let's get into the weird reason you would buy this figure. I hope so. Now, this is him with the um, saw blade. Now, the reason this worked, um, not reason, but the reason he did this figure because in the show, Rex's saw would split, well, the front two ends would split up and it spin really fast, creating the saw. Pretty epic. Uh, one thing inaccurate orange paint job, black handle on the wrong side. Besides that, exact same figure with a different head sculpt. In my opinion, the head sculpt should have been reversed. But who cares? Uh, legs, same, no holes, been that far, been that, that far, no elbow, but 360 uh, shoulder, 360 head, and same articulation. And again, same problem, can't get it to bend, can't get the elbow joint, ah, wrist joint to work. But you do get more plastic. One, you get more plastic with the Evo. Two. You entirely get a, this new piece, which has pretty much the same plastic as the original one, I guess. And you get this hunk of plastic here, and you get metal. Um, because you use metal to keep this in. Which, on the packaging, let me bring in another packaging, actually was covered by plastic. So, that's not zooming in. But, I'm glad they didn't. Int? Why would you be glad? Well, one, you would probably always have them posed like this. Two, I'm glad they use metal because A, it's Mattel using metal. When do they ever use metal besides in the spring? I have a point. I would have liked, though, if they released a variant of this figure that had the uh, plastic cap here or a solid plastic thing, but I'm glad they want the metal because it's metal on. A um, Mattel toy. You know, they usually do that for subtle things like chains once in a while, springs. But they really never use metal that much. That's why. Now, um, it spins quite well. And you can be all... Okay, it's wood. So... And it doesn't hurt. Thank you, Mattel. I would have probably died. You are all not invited to my funeral. Just saying. Nah, I'm kidding. You can come. Um, this is going to be a quick review. I mean, it's literally the exact same figure with a reused head sculpt. We used on pieces with a new blade. So, uh, yeah. I do recommend this figure. Yes, this is on the wrong side. Yes, this is orange. But, it's the only way to get the saw mode. I dig it. And you get cool evil that's actually been in the show. I do wish it was brown though. So, this is Bow Ball signing off with a very quick video review. Because, it's literally the exact same figure. Minus one thing. And a Wii U's Ted Skull. Okay. Bye. As, uh, oh wait, before I go bye. Wow, I usually do say my sentences with words in front of them. Don't I? Um, as always, there will be a new video on Wednesday, which will be my Batman video. So, get ready for that. Until then, click the like button. Subscribe. Leave a comment. Put it on your favorites list. And I will see you on Wednesday. Goodbye, YouTube. Goodbye. Till Wednesday. That's right. Okay, now I can leave.